All right, guys, here we are. Here's the League of Legends top or bottom freaky, freaky tier list. Um, this is going to be insane. There is so many male characters in this game for me to write that I feel like this is going to be this is going to be a big one. I'm just going to say it right now. There's a lot of uh, there's a lot of monster characters in this. So this is definitely going to be a very freaky, a very freaky tier list. If you know what I mean, if you know what I mean, <laughs> we have the same tiers. We have the destroy me top tier, the submissive top tier, the verse king tier, the power bottom, the be destroyed bottom tier, and then the Absolutely not. Nope tier for anybody who is not really applicable. And we'll probably run into some of those, considering how diverse the cast of League of Legends is. But let's just jump right into it. And first off, we have Aatrox. And I'm just, this is so easy. Destroy me. Like, do I even need to explain? If you know who Aatrox is and you know what he looks like, that's that's one big daddy demon. Okay, that's one big daddy demon. He's he's a destroy me top. And now we have Akshan. He's a verse. He just gives me verse. I don't know. It's his personality. He's just he's very smug, you know? I feel like there's going to be a lot of tops. I'm just going to say that right now. There's League. It's going to be League of Tops. Speaking of top, Alistair is a Destroy Me top as well. Think you can handle the bowl, guys? You think you can handle the bowl? You can't milk those. Damn, this is going to be a really freaky video. Um, And then we have a Moo Moo, and I am not rating a Moo Moo. That is a literal, that is a literal crying child. I am not rating that. Um, we have Aurelian Soul. He's a power bottom. You heard it here. Aurelian Soul. He's a power bottom. Don't ask me why. That's just where I'm putting him. And now we have Azir. I, I don't know where the hell I'm gonna put Azir. Like where where the heck would I even put him? I'll, okay, there's one one thing's for certain. Azir Azir is not a destroy me top. I feel like he'd be a submissive top. I think that's the right placement for him. And now we have Aphelios. And Aphelios is a bottom. And you wanna know why? Because Set is his top. <laughs> That is, that is canon. Literally canon. Uh, yeah. Set, set is his top. Aphelios is the bottom. There you go. Um, and now we have Bard. I don't even want to think about Bard in any of these. Bard seems too innocent for that. Bard is like too innocent for that. So you know what? We're just not going to rate him. He's too innocent. Bard is just a little free spirit guy. Okay. He's not, he's not getting into any of us. Knowing Blitzcrank and what he does to you, He's a freaking, he's a destroy you because he's annoying as hell. Okay, when you're getting pulled, you're getting fisted, okay? That's what Blitzcrank's doing to you, he's fisting. Um, and now we have Brand. And Brand is Power Bottom. I don't know why, I just literally looked at him and just like immediately thought Power Bottom. Now Braum. A part of me feels like Braum would be a submissive top, I don't know why. But at the same time, he's kind of just giving top. But also at the same time, what if he's a verse? I don't know, he's got that big shield. He's like literally carrying a door. Like he's definitely a destroy me top. I, I don't think I can put him anywhere else. I think if I put him anywhere else, that would be like a total fabrication. Like that just would not make sense. And now we have Cho'Gath. And Cho'Gath is also, also a destroy me top. You know, he's got that big bite, okay? He's got that big chompers. He's eating you. He's eating you up like a little snack. You know what I mean? He's going to destroy you for sure. You might even die, honestly. Um, and then we have Corky, and I don't even want to think about Corky in any of this. Corky's a bottom. <laughs> nah, Corky's definitely a submissive top. I feel like Corky is one of those tops that doesn't do anything. That That's that's the T. Um, Darius isn't destroying me because uh, I literally just want to be destroyed by Darius. Let's be real. His brother, Draven, is giving me verse. Honestly, he could be a power bottom, but like he's kind of giving me verse. I feel like, you know, he spins those axes. I don't know why that has anything to do with being verse, but can I put him in verse and then say that he's he's like both? He's a just he's, he's a top, but he's like a submissive top and a destroy me top at the same time. I feel like he could do both. So we're going to keep him in verse because of that reason. And now we have Mundo. And guess what? Mundo is also a destroy me top. Is that a surprise? I told you this is going to be League of Tops. So get ready. <laughs> Have you seen Mundo when he ults? That is a top. You cannot tell me otherwise. Like, Mundo is supposed to be ugly and I fear they just made him hot. I'm gonna be honest, I don't know if Echo is actually applicable or not. Okay, yeah, for the sake of like, I don't really know what to do with him. We're just gonna say no. Um, and then we have Ezreal and he's the bottom. Riot is not fooling anybody with the Lux Ezreal ship. Ezreal is fooling nobody, okay? Lux is a beard. 100%. As real is a bottom, and that is just that. Um, and then we have fiddlesticks. <laughs> do you think fiddlesticks is gonna fiddle your sticks? I mean, do you want to get fiddled by the fiddlesticks? 
You know what? Fiddlesticks, I feel like, would be a destroy-me top. <laughs> um, and then we have Fizz. I'm gonna be real. I don't know what the hell Fizz would go into. Um, that, that is a fish, and I don't think he's getting into any of that either. And then we have Galio. Galio is also a destroy-me top. <laughs> Girl, this is looking very skewed already. I fear... I fear this is just too many tops. What do we do? Look at that, now we have Gangplank, and do you want to know where he's going to? Oh my god. No, you know what? Gangplank's a submissive top. Yeah. Gangplank's a submissive top, for sure. And then we have Garen. And Garen, to me, is also... No, Garen's a verse. Garen's a verse. I feel like he seems so himbo-y. Like, I don't know, he just seems so, like, baby girl. I feel like he could do both, for sure. And then we have Nar, uh, baby form. That is not applicable at all. That is a child. That is a baby. And then we have Gragas. You guys are probably gonna question this. Gragas is a power bottom. Or maybe just a bottom in general. You know what? Gragas is a bottom. <laughs> How do you guys feel about that? How do you feel about that? Gragas is a bottom. I feel pretty good about that. Um, and then we have Graves. And, you know, he's one of the canon gays. He's one of the canon gays. Let's just be honest. Graves is the top. Everyone in League is a freaking top. Hecarim, that's also a top. All right, that's a freaking, that's a horse. You know what he's got down there. Heimerdinger, submissive top. No, you know what? Heimerdinger's too pure for that. He ain't getting into any of that. Um, and then we have Ivern. I also feel like Ivern is too pure for this. Ivern's just the dude. He's just a dude. He's just a tree. Ivern's a bottom, though. If I have to put him anywhere, he's a bottom, for sure. Jarvan's a top. You know, he's just slamming right onto you with his ultimate. He's big. He's a big man. Anyways, he's a top. Um, we have Jax, and I feel like he's first. You wanna know my reasons? It's because you can build anything on that stupid character and he'll still do so much damage. So that means he's a verse. Um, and then we have Jace. And you know what? He's a verse too. He's, he's got that shape-shifting hammer. Jace, I feel like, could definitely do both. I feel like he's that, like, one guy, that, that one dude that, like, really, really wants you to believe he's a top, but he's actually not. <gasps> That's kind of the vibes I get from Jace. Um, and then we have Jin. He's a... I don't know. I feel like Jin could go anywhere. So I feel like maybe we put him in verse too. I feel like he'd be very dominant. Maybe he's a power bottom. No, you know what? We're going to put him in verse, and I feel like he would be a power bottom and a destroy me top. Like, he's he's in control, basically. He's in control. He's not going to let the other person have any control. He's going to, like, tie you up, basically. Jin is the BDSM king of this whole thing. And then we have Karthus. Uh, I don't know if he's getting into any of that, because I don't know if he actually physically can. <laughs> Karthus is a submissive top. I can't even give you a reasoning on that. Maybe you can think of one yourself. If you can think of a reasoning, leave that in the comments because, uh, yeah. Um, and then we have Cassidin. Girl, what the hell is Cassidin? Um, I feel like he would be a top. I mean, some of his skins definitely make him more appealing. <laughs> yeah, we're just gonna put him in the top tier because, again, it's League of Tops. Um, and then we have Kane, and he's a verse, 100%. That's, like, such an easy answer. Kane can do it all, okay? He literally, he can do it all. He can transform into an assassin. He can transform into a bruiser. He's got his, like, demon form, his shadow assassin form. He's got two forms. He's literally both. He's verse. Um, and then we have Kennen. Now, Kennen, I don't know. She's just kind of like a little rat. You know what? Kennen's verse. <laughs> you want to know why he's verse? Because I said so, that's why. Um, and now we have Kha'Zix. Uh, Kha'Zix is a freaking... I don't know, I feel like Kha'Zix is just a top. I feel like Kha'Zix would be one of those tops that would, like, do the deed and then eat you afterwards. I don't know who's interested in that, but I certainly am not. And then we have Kled. Kled is an annoying rat, and he's a submissive top. And now we have Kogma. Kogma's too pure for that. He's li Kogma's literally just too pure for that. Like, I can't rate that thing. He's Kogma's supposed to be ugly, but he's cute, and he's too pure for that. He seems so innocent. He just, he's just a baby. Um, Kasante is a freaking destroy me top. Or he might be a verse. You know what? Kasante's a verse. Well, he's a verse, but like 90% destroy me top. But he's also a power bottom. Definitely. I feel like Kasante can do both. Uh, Lee Sin is a submissive top. No, you know what? He's a top. He's a top. He's he's like kicking you all over the place. He's very forceful, so very dominant. Uh, Lucian. I feel like Lucian would be a submissive top. Malphite. He's also a destroy me top. And the reason Malphite is a destroy me top is because that ultimate is literally f me up every time he uses it. So yeah. Malzahar. If I'm taking skins into consideration, I feel like he's a bottom for sure. Yeah, Malzahar's a bottom, definitely. And then we have Maokai. Maokai is an actual tree. Like he's just literally a tree. Maokai's also a top. 
Guys, there's too many tops. What the hell are we gonna do? There's literally too many tops. There's literally no power bottoms. I'm gonna have to find some more power bottoms. You know what? I actually know exactly who I'm gonna put in power bottom. Rakan. That's a power bottom. Rakan is a power... No, you know what? He should be in first, but I'm gonna put him in power bottom. Here's the, here's my thing. He's like totally a power bottom, but like he's he's like verse. You know, he's like kind of verse, but he's definitely a power bottom. He, he's a power bottom for sure. And you know what? Yi Yi's also a power bottom. I get that from Yi. Yi could be a power bottom. I think this is Monster Nar. He's a top. Uh, Mordekaiser is a top as well. Nasus is a top as well. <laughs> Nautilus is a top as well. There's too many tops. Help me. What do we do? Uh, Nocturne is a bottom. No, no you know what? Nocturne's a submissive top. Nunu is a literal child, so not applicable. Olaf is a top. Orn, I feel like, is a verse. Uh, Pantheon's a freaking top. Oh my god, is he ever a top? Holy sh**. Pike, I feel like, is a power bottom. That is so incorrect. He's not a power bottom. Do I need to move any of these people around? I'm thinking here for a second. I feel like Kedden in verse makes literally no sense. I can't even think of, like, any placement for this thing. You know what? He's not applicable. Let's just be honest with ourselves. I literally cannot think of a placement for him. I just, like, I literally cannot. Um, but Pike... Pike is a submissive top. Uh, Ramus is a, a turtle. <laughs> Ramus ain't no destroy me top. He's a turtle. Ramus is a submissive top. And you you want to hear my reasoning on this? He taunts you into attacking him. So he makes you do all the work. That makes sense, right? I think that makes sense. Um, Renekton's a destroy me top. Absolutely. Rengar, also a destroy me top. Absolutely. Way is a freaking bottom. This version of Kane is the top. Now, he here's the thing. This is why regular human Kane fits so well in the verse, because his de demonic form, his darkened form, is the top, for sure. Absolutely. And then his shadow assassin form right here, that's a bottom. Rumble, girl, that's a freaking teddy bear. Rumble, Rumble's a bottom. Now, Rise. Rise is a power bottom. He's a power bottom. Uh, Shaco is a terrifying, terrifying clown that I feel like would literally murder you. So, Shaco is also a BDSM top, but like a really freaky one, you know? Uh, Shen, I feel like would be verse. I don't know why, I just kind of get those vibes from him. Like, I feel like he could do both. Uh, Singed is a submissive top. He's too lazy to do anything, but he also doesn't want a bottom. And he also smells. And then Scion is a freaking top. Absolutely. Uh, Skarner is ugly, and I don't want to think about anything freaky to do with that. But if I had to place him anywhere, how could Skarner be a bottom? I don't see that for him. Swain is a top. Have you seen that freaking Swain skin? Oh my god, the prestige skin. That is like the most top of top I've ever seen in this game right now. And then we have Silas. Silas is a verse. No question about it. Silas is absolutely a verse. Absolutely. We actually have a pretty decent amount of verses. Uh, Tom Kench is a submissive top. And now we have Talon. And Talon would be... I feel like he's a top. Tarek is a verse. He's a verse. Tarek could do both. I feel like Tarek could literally do everything on this list. He could literally do everything. He's the true verse. Um, Teemo is way too innocent for this. But if I had to put him anywhere, he's the bottom. But he's too innocent for this. Teemo shall not be rated. Uh, Thresh... Okay, here's the thing. Thresh in his default skin is a destroy me top. Thresh in his spirit blossom skin is probably <laughs> still also a destroy me top. Let's be real. Um, and now we have Trundle and traditional Trundle. That is a destroy me top. That's a destroy me top right there. Trindamir, a destroy me top. Like, absolutely. And now we have Twisted Fae and Twisted Fae is a verse. He's a verse, but he did, he only bottoms. You know what I mean? He's a power bottom and a regular bottom. Um, and now we have Twitch and that's a rat. He would be a bottom though. Uh, and then we have Udyr, that's a top. You know what? He's a verse. Udyr's a verse. And my reasoning for that is he's a shapeshifter. He's, he's like, he's sh shapeshifting into all these different creatures. He's very versatile. But I mean, now we have Urgot. Urgot, I would not touch with a 10-foot pole. Urgot ain't bottoming for anybody. So he's probably gonna be a destroy me top. He ain't gonna destroy me, though. Uh, Varus is a verse. I feel like that's correct. Um, Vigar? <laughs> um, Vigar, this is gonna be completely platonic. He's a destroy me top because he blows the sh** out of you. Let's be real. He will explode you. Like, you will literally disintegrate. That's what Vigar does to you. Honestly, same with Velkaz. She's also going to disintegrate you. He's got those tentacles. Okay, he's he's grabbing you. He's grabbing you with those little tentacles. Um, And now we have Viego. I'm going to be real. I feel like Viego could do both. I kind of do. I feel like he's so pretty. He could do both. Uh, Victor. Like, arcane version of Victor is like... A bottom, 1000%. So you know what? He's going to be a bottom. Victor's a bottom. Um, Vladimir is a verse. I feel like he could do both. 
Uh, maybe he's a top, but we oh. have way too many tops. Okay, he's got to be retired. We got to retire some of these tops and give them some different areas because there's too many. So Vladimir is a verse, okay? That's where you are being assigned to, Vladimir. Be happy. You know, he's sucking your blood. I'm sure he's sucking something else too. And now we have Volley Bear. And sadly, I have to put him in the destroying oh. top because I just, I can't. He's just, there's just too many tops. Warwick, he's also a top. Well, well, I mean, nah, he's 100% he's top. How could I put Warwick anywhere else? He's a little werewolf. He just radiates yeah. dominance. Like, I can't. Wukong. Wukong's a power bottom. Wukong's a power bottom for sure. You know, he knows how to work that pole arm of his. And then we have, uh, what the hell is that? Zareth? I almost forgot his name for a second. That's Zareth. What the hell is Zareth? Okay, okay. Default skin Zareth is a destroy me top. And then Arcana Zareth, that's a bottom. And now we have the last little bit of characters left here. Uh, we have Zinjo. And he, I feel like he's a submissive top. Definitely a submissive top. We have Yasuo. Yasuo is, you know, there's that one skin of Yasuo. He's a top. Yone, I feel like could be verse because he kind of, he's, you know, he's kind of serving. He's like, he's a little girly pop. You know what I mean? Yone, he's a little girly pop. But Yasuo is like the straight brother of the two. Yone is definitely the more girly pop. Yorick? How I just have to put Yorick in top. I don't think there's another place for him. Zack? He's verse. Zack is that Zack is a true verse. Okay. He's he can like shape shift into all these different forms, you know. He's very verse. Very versatile. Very stretchy. <laughs> and now we have Zed. Just for the sake of filling up this category, he's a power bottom. Same with Zillion. Even though Zillion's definitely a submissive top. Nah, Z Zillion's a dismissive top. And then we have Ziggs, the last little furry rat thing. Ziggs is a power bottom. Don't ask me why. All right, that's the tier. Do you guys love the tier? Is it is it correct? Do you think it's correct? Honestly, this was incredibly difficult. I'm sure there's some very cursed placements here. I can already see some cursed placements. If you have any opinions about where you would place some of these characters, you can leave those in the comments below. And I always read them. I will always look through. This is a very large tier list, and I fear I'm probably not going to do one that's as big as this ever again, because that was really difficult. <laughs> but if you want to see any of my other tier lists, I have an Overwatch one, a Gen an impact one, a Honkai Star Wars one, and a Zenless. I do not have a Zenless Song Zero one. Why did I say that? I have a Wuthering Waves one as well. But yeah, if you enjoyed this video, please feel free to subscribe, and I will catch you in the next one. Bye bye.